August is now behind us. And with that, another slate of incredible tables, including three, count them, three from v -Pin Workshop. We're going to check all these out right here, right now, on Digital Victory. First up, Johnny Mnemonic from the V-Pin Workshop. Yet another gem by arguably the best team around for pinball creation for the virtual world. These guys don't mess around. Access code one, activated. All right, shoot left ramp, okay. Now I don't know anything about this table. Looks to be pretty sophisticated. Perhaps a uh, candidate for a tutorial, huh? Let's go. This is Johnny Mnemonic from the V-Pin Workshop. Launch the ball. We got a lot to look at, so let's dip out and check out another. Embryonic This is Embryon. This is by Uncle Polly and some other folks that gave him a hand. This is an update of an older table from back in the day. As you can see, it's a wide body. So it's gonna look a little different on, on the standard monitor here. But on the corrections he's done, he's created an enhanced play field. He's added VTW level physics, dynamic shadows, fleet sounds. Improved just about every aspect of it. You gotta be careful on the left. They got those reverse in lane and out lanes. Not sure what the prize is when you spell it, but that's what I'm trying to do here. I played this just a little bit, and man, it just feels so nice. It's great, great production here. Great job by Uncle Polly and his team. I'm trying to hit that captive ball in the middle. There we go. That's how you spell those letters? I love it. This is Embryon by Uncle Polly. Let's go check out another. Well, here's a little gem I had not heard of. Hoops by Wilty. This is a 1991 Gottlieb table. And Wilty has completely updated it with Enfazi physics, uh, fleet mechanical sounds. Roth's Flipper Tricks, which I don't really know what that is, so if someone knows about that, uh, throw some information for me in the comments, please. Uh, he's included sling corrections, object positioning, and a whole slew of improvements and upgrades all over the table. Let's check it out. Yeah, let's shoot some hoops. Ooh, I like that. Sounds like the sound chip from the Sega Genesis. <laughs> Yikes. Hey, did you hear that? That sure sounded a lot like Fathom. Yes. Well, I like the way this plays. The physics are fantastic. And the flippers feel great. I'm sure it has something to do with the Roth's flipper tricks he talked about. Nice. Hey, nice lighting, too. Oh, dang it. Hoops by Wilty. I like it. Let's check out another.
another VPW masterpiece. This is Defender from Williams Electronics, 1980. And let me tell you, this table is not for the faint of heart. This is brutal. But still fun, very challenging. Gotta be patient and be willing to accept the fact that some games are gonna be really quick. That's the beauty of virtual pinball, right? We just push that start button again. Target on the left there. Nice. I like the fact that it's got actual pop-up targets. That's really cool. Oh! Shoot. Two down. Last ball. See if we can't make something a little more interesting out of this game. No promises. And it's over. Okay. That is Defender from VPW. Accurately presented by VPW as the tough game that it is. Let's check out another. This is X-Files, the Siggy mod. And this is gorgeous. Look at this. You guys uh, hang out on my channel very much. You know, I recently did a tutorial of a table of the X-Files and it was the table by Tasty Wasps. Siggy used that table to do his modifications here. Really like it. Multi ball ready. Let's go. I love that alien in the middle, right above the X. That's awesome. Potential restart though. Let's see if we can get that done. X Files, the Siggy mod. Let's look at another. Hey, I'm going to give another shout out here to Tyson. Thank you for all of your hard work in upgrading a lot of these old EM tables. He has taken a lot of these loser man tables that he was kind enough to produce and enhanced them, improved the lighting, improved the graphics, fixed up some of the artwork, made a couple tweaks here and there, and it just made them better top to bottom. We appreciate your hard work, Tyson. This is Police Force, the third table of last month from VGW, VPIN Workshop. This is a 1989 Williams table, and I'll be honest with you, I was not even familiar with it. But like many other tables I'd never heard of, once I started playing it, I love it. I think this is cool as heck. Now, years ago, GTX Joe started the creation of this and didn't quite get it finished, but it was recently revived by Miwok. And he started working on it again. The entire team of VPW pitched in. And what you see here is the result of that. And I think it's awesome. One of the coolest aspects of 
is the ability to adjust your camera on a much more uh, granular scale than the previous tables. Look at it. I mean, it has a much deeper 3D look than I can get with 10.7, and I love that about it. Awesome table. Police Force from VPW. Let's check out another. I present to you Logan's Run. This is by Jay Rourke. And this is a modification of an older table called Arena. And he has made it his own. I think he's done an amazing job of capturing the flavor of the movie. The colors, the look and feel of it. Terrific. Whoa, did you see that? Lazarus. I love it. Now, do you remember Logan's Run? I saw it way back in the day, but I don't remember it. Get in there. Oh. like that. You knock down those targets to get behind it, but you have a limited time. I dig this. Logan's Run by Jay Rourke. Let's check out another. This is Lord of the Rings, the Valinor edition. This is also by the VPen Workshop. VPW has created this latest update to an already incredible version that was introduced in January of last year. And this is another 10.8 table. So again, if you haven't updated, it's time to do so because all the best creations are coming out in version 10.8. This has been upgraded with improved physics, improved artwork and lighting, and they have the in-game options menu with lots of different options. Let me show you what uh, I mean by that. So here we go, we got the color LUTs, outpost difficulty, Playfield toys, on or off. The plunger tip. The ball, different color ball. I use the gold glow ball, which is, uh, to me, really cool. But I'll just show you real quick what some of the options are. A green glow, a magna glow, a normal, or the gold. Mechanical volume, ramp volume, ball volume, dynamic ball shadows, ambient ball shadows, the flashers. The VR room, turn it on or off, and the different VR rooms that you can select from. And the identification here, version 1.4. Render mode, and back to the color LUTs. Hey, let's go. I'm running. There are several different versions of this table that have been out over the years. And I like most of them, to be honest with you. But this one is above and beyond. This is just spectacular in every way. That is so satisfying when you shoot it through the spinner into the ring. Man, that's nice. Woo! Lord of the Rings Valinor Edition by VPW. One of the best around. Let's go check out another. All right, let's check this out. This is Avengers Pro by Tasty Wasp and his entire team. There is a team on this one. The goal was to make it all the way up to current VPW standards. And that includes Enfazi physics, fleet sounds, all the playfield artwork, the lighting, the VR, and Tasty Wasps did an incredible job. 
Look at this. Look at that. Let's go. Holy crap, this is amazing. He's blown away, man. This is awesome. Well, if you like good tables with great themes, incredible action, great lighting, and amazing rules, this one's for you. Avengers Pro Stern by Tasty Wasps and his amazing team. Let's look at another. Behold, this is Batman Forever by Draken. This is an update of an older, biggest mod, and this includes all the usual things you'd expect for updates and upgrades, fleet mechanical sounds, and Fozzy physics, LUT color selectors, all that. This table has it all. If you follow my channel, you know I just did a tutorial on this table just a week or so ago. Make sure you check that out. I got the link below. This table's awesome. Check it out. Multi ball, let's go. table Batman forever I love it what a month of August this month was a blast with a lot of amazing tables already looking forward to September Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks so much for watching, and we'll see you guys on the next one. Bye.